hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are going to learn with the new topic with the laravel and firebase for php okay so guys we'll be using our firebase with the php and laravel application so guys let's get started so we are going to do a crud application using laravel 6 which is available over here so let's go to our firebase php documentation where you'll find installation under overview laravel so let's click on this Control click you'll move to github repository and let's go below guys here is the firebase for laravel okay so installation part laravel thing right so you need to install this laravel firebase in your laravel application so before getting started you need to install this so what version you're going to install laravel so currently the version is 8 but our firebase php for laravel it provides that is 6 guys so 7 and 8 this package is not available few things so let's begin with it guys let's go check out with laravel 6.x installation installing laravel move below here is a code guys so let's copy this command and i want to create the project over here so let's open the git bash guys and now copy this get back to your git bash paste and rename this as laravel 6 firebase okay hit enter so guys let's wait until it gets installed so guys, our application installed successfully. Let's close this terminal and here is our Laravel 6 Firebase and open with git bash and open with code guys. So let's move to our command prompt where php artisan serve hit enter. So it's started. Let's close this. Go to URL. Let's type localhost 8000. Let's keep at first. Perfect guys. So this is our Laravel application. So under resource views on the welcome blade, we have the output where Laravel plus Firebase for PHP okay save cool guys so now we are going to get started with firebase installation firebase PHP installation so let's move to github repository and installation part first thing let's copy this get back to your application start your terminal and paste the code hit enter so it's installing so guys let's wait for the complete installation perfect yes so it has been successfully installed let's kill this terminal and yep guys let's get back next step need to go to your inside your laravel so you need to go to app.php under config folder and copy this copy let's go to config app.php move below so this is the providers and paste that give comma all set let's close this and again this is for lumen not required and now guys you need to do the configuration so first let us publish this copy and control tilde symbol back tick to open your terminal guys and hit enter 
perfect so you can find that firebase.php file also over here so yep let's close this and now let's get back let us set the credentials so go to your env file so copy dot env file and after database only i want to paste that so firebase credential and then your database url so paste it all set guys let's give it double quotes so guys to get the firebase credential and database url you need to create a project first so let's get started with it so let's move to our firebase console and with your email id just log in and create a project so let's add a project my project name will be laravel firebase tutorial okay hit enter so you are going to next step let's continue this and the service account let's select default account for firebase create a project creating a project guys so let's wait for this perfect so it's done guys and now let's continue okay so here is our firebase laravel firebase tutorial so guys now you need to go to your settings over here project settings and generate the which credentials so you need to move over your service account and we are using firebase admin sdk and just create a service account so let's click on create perfect so it's created guys and now you can generate a new private key let's click download this generated key and it's over here guys now let's take this so let's move to downloads windows e and this is the code guys so let's control x and paste into your firebase application directly so this is my root directory where i have pasted this perfect guys so let's copy okay control c get back to your application where you can find this over here okay and paste it over here perfect done and then database url we are missing so let's get back and yes guys so let's move to our build inside that build we are going to work with real-time database so in for this video we'll be seeing learning about this authentication firestore database everything okay so click on real-time database and create database guys done so i'm going to select united state only next let's select with this start in test mode and enable it perfect so our database is created guys and this is our database link so let's copy this and done let's get back to our application and paste it all set guys so now let's get back if you change anything in your dot env file you need to restart your application otherwise error will be given so guys we have successfully done how to install our laravel and firebase in php with your database connection and creating the credential of your service account in this video so guys let's see in next video how to insert the data in laravel firebase so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share